Okay, Pat again, and in this segment, we're gonna talk about the status button that is in the information panel. So here I am at the main screen, and you'll notice when I tap the status that it's a flyout window. All of the buttons except for the keyboard and the calculator that are located on the left hand of the screen work this way. No matter where I'm at in the control at the time, this window will fly out over the top. In this case, the status is showing me whether I'm working in inches or millimeters, two axis or three axis. It'll give me the name of the program if I have one in the control. It'll show me which versions of software I'm running. Um, it'll also show me the options that are in the control that the end user has purchased. And then whether I have the options, uh, all of the options or not, I still have the ability to turn them off. Sometimes people say, hey, you know, with electronic hand wheels, it'd be nice if I could disable them so that they don't accidentally move when I'm using the machine. Well, now I can turn them off and it'll disable them so I can do exactly that. When I'm done with the status mode, simply touch it again, the window will close, and I'll move on to the next thing that I want to do. Hey, everybody, it's Tracking Pat here with some of my best guys from the assembly department, reminding you that if you like these videos, don't forget to push the like button. If you want to subscribe so that we have a better idea who's watching us, hit the subscribe button over here. And of course, if you want to see the next video, then slam this one over here. And as always, I hope you enjoy the video. And most importantly, don't forget, keep on tracking.